What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. I am in Santa Cruz currently for one more day, still celebrating Christian's birthday. And while we have been doing a pretty good job of staying active, yesterday we went for like a two and a half hour hike slash walk in the Redwoods. Today I thought that it is raining outside, so maybe I would just get a body weight glute workout in. You will need a hip thruster loop or any kind of band that you might have, like a Perform Better, whatever, wherever you get your bands from. But other than that, this is the only equipment you will need. This will be a totally hotel approved, vacation ready glute workout for you. I do have a couple other hotel room or like on the go, do at home, no equipment necessary videos. I will be sure to link those in the description box. But other than that, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, make sure you have post notifications turned on, and make sure you're following me on Instagram for daily health, wellness, and fitness tips. I'm gonna go through each of the supersets with you. We're gonna do each superset three times. So let's go ahead and get started on our first superset. Okay, so our first superset is going to be 20 pulsing squats. I had to, I feel like I'm using that exercise a lot lately, but I am really into it. 20 pulsing squats into 20 total lateral band walks. So I'm gonna show you what that looks like. We're gonna take the band and put it just above our knees. And then basically we're just gonna squat down and instead of coming all the way back up, we're just gonna stay down for a total of 20. Okay, finish 20 of those, right into a banded lateral walk. We're gonna focus on pushing off of the leg we're leaving behind, not so much stepping out with the leg in front. I like to almost push, like with my hand here, just to really focus on which leg should be feeling it. going to be 20 total, so that's really 10 each leg. Cool. So since it is just body weight and all we're doing is using a band, you can kind of make the decision for yourself about whether you want to take like a 60 second break or just go right into the next superset. But either way, we're gonna do three of those three sets total. Okay, our next super set, we're gonna take it to the ground a little bit. So I have put a blanket on the ground and beware because dogs might think it's for them. But we're gonna do some banded hip lifts because our feet are going to be up. So if you're in a hotel room or you're at home, you have some sort of a chair or a bed or a desk, something that you can use. I can pretty much guarantee that. We're gonna put our legs up on that, our feet up there, and then we're gonna go to the ground, all the way to the ground, and do some supine abductions. Okay, so once again, the band is just above our knees. I'm gonna make sure my feet are flat for the most part, and then we're just gonna come up, squeeze for 20. Here's 18, 19, 20, and then right all the way to the ground for 20 supine abductions. So we're just taking the knees out. on that last one. 
You don't have to do that. <laughs> okay, so it's gonna be another three sets total of those two exercises back to back. Again, you can decide for yourself based on your own level if you wanna take a 30 to 60 second rest period or get right back into that next set. Okay, now we are ditching the band, at least for the moment, and we're going to go back to that same chair, desk, bed, whatever you were using for your hip lifts, and we're gonna do some rear foot elevated split squats. Just body weight, so again, our lucky number today is 20. We're gonna do 20 each side. I'm gonna start with my right foot elevated. Whoop. Find that good distance. <laughs> and we've just got 20 here. And then we'll go ahead and switch sides. Your foot position might be a little bit different if your legs are not exactly the same one. <laughs> Once again, we're gonna do three sets total, so that's gonna be two more sets of 20 on each leg. And then we'll move on to our final superset. Okay, so our final superset of this workout is again without a band. We're gonna take it back down to the ground for some sideline leg lifts. And then we're gonna take it to the bed for some quadruped leg swings. Again, 20 of each. I'm gonna walk you through that first set. I've got the blanket down again. I'm gonna just cradle my head in my hand and we're just lifting up and back down for 20. Okay, so we just finished our first set of the sideline leg lifts and we were lifting our right leg. We're gonna go directly into the quadruped leg swings, swinging that right leg, and then we'll go back down to the floor for the other side of the sideline leg lifts. Hopefully that makes sense. So we're here, we're on all fours. I actually, this is kind of short, but that's probably not normal. <laughs> like that's not standard. And we're just gonna swing up and really squeeze that glute at the top for another 20. Okay, so that is a total of four different sets that are gonna get us through one whole at-home, vacation-ready, hotel room approved glute workout. I hope you guys really enjoyed that. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below in the comments. I would love that so much. Otherwise, give this workout a try, subscribe to the channel, turn post notifications on, and make sure you're following me on Instagram for daily health, wellness, and fitness tips. I'll see you guys next time.